says, overcome seven to go to heaven. You must overcome seven to go to heaven because God created heaven and earth and animals and man in six days and on the seventh day God ended his work which he had made and he rested on the seventh day from all his work which he had made. So number seven is perfect number. So you must be perfect in overcoming everything so you can go to heaven. And it's not you who will overcome, but Jesus in you. But you must have perfect obedience to Jesus. In Revelation, it's written seven times the word, He who overcomes, to the seven angels of seven churches. The first one in Revelation chapter 2 verse 7, He who has an ear, let him hear what the Spirit says to the churches. To him who overcomes, I will give the right to eat from the tree of life, which is in the paradise of God. And Revelation 2.11, 2.17, 2.26, 3.5, 3.8, Three twenty one. But if you want to overcome and to be more than conqueror, you must overcome number eight. To inherit all, you must overcome eight. In Romans chapter eight, verse thirty thirty seven. No, in all these things we are more than conquerors to him that love. So if you want to be more than conqueror, you must, in, if you want to inherit all, in Revelation chapter 21 verse 7, he who overcomes will inherit all this and I will be his God and he will be my son. So, my friend, if you want to go to heaven, you must overcome seven. But if you want to be more than conqueror and to have victory and to overcome and to inherit all, you must overcome eight, which is he who overcomes will inherit all this. So, if you want this promise, my friend, you must overcome and more than conqueror you must overcome more which is number eight in revelation 21 7 so my friend in jesus we can overcome and we can be perfect in in our victory and we can also inherit all if we obey jesus till the end god bless you He which testifies these things said, Surely I come quickly. Amen. Even so, come, Lord Jesus.